uh, the topic today is vectors 2. Now, we are going to look at coordinates in two dimension and in three dimension. Now, in form two, we learned that the position of a point in the Cartesian plane is specified by the ordered pair AB, as shown, where A is the number of units um, and in the direction of the x-axis and, and B is the number of units in the direction of y axis and this is shown in the diagram uh, you can see we have the x axis and the y axis now the point that you're talking about is a b in between the ordered pair there on the x axis we have a units from the origin zero zero and uh, b uh, b units on the y axis from the origin as shown now this is how the position of a point is explained in two dimension the dimensions are the x and y dimensions. In three dimension, a third axis is introduced, the z axis. And uh, this is shown in the diagram. You can see we have the x axis, this one, this side. Then there is the y axis. And then there is the z axis, which is the vertical axis. The position of a point is determined in three dimensions by giving the x, y, and z axis. The coordinate is given as a, b, c, where a, b, and c are the, um, are the units or, or are the distances from the point of the point from the origin in the x, y, and z axis.